Hello to everyone. So the presentation is set. And uh, my call today, my call this year, is the call for mobile adventure. It's a call for the executive in the room, executive in web departments, in strategy department, in marketing department, but also to the executive in creative, in advertising, uh, and in web agency. Uh, it has been just one year that I've been in the mobile industry. It's been a fantastic year. Uh, and I call this year an adventure. But I want to start off uh, this talk with a surprise. And the surprise is one figure, 25. A, an amazing paradox is, first of all, 25 million. This is the number of smartphones there are in Germany just right now. 25 million is spreading like hell. There are many new products, and we've seen what's happening in the next few years in the three uh, talk before uh, this one. But the big paradox is the 25%. 25, and only 25% uh, of marketers and brands have dedicated mobile strategies, dedicated mobile website application. So it is, and even the, the, the mobile advertising business is very small. It's about 150 million, which is very small. So a tremendous paradox between the spreading of mobile and the way it is treated, especially in Germany. So I wanted to really share, first of all, that surprise and, and sum it up. There's been a lot of talks. There are a lot of conferences about mobiles but there are very few investment. So I want to start this conversation with you today just to yeah, change this within the next 10 minutes. So to change this, and this is my first call, we all have to enter and discover the mobile industry and the mobile territory. And um, I've been really enthusiastic in the last 12 months with this industry. Uh, and I'll just sum it up, what I've, what I've seen and what I'm experiencing. We've got the best engineers and developers not only on the West Coast, but everywhere also in Europe, who wants and who are working on mobiles. Fantastic devices, a lot of new businesses, many new ideas, apps in billion, but also these users in million. And I don't know whether you do that in that industry, but I myself my, make my market research, okay? So when I am in train or in parties, I always look at the phones, okay? And sometimes I even reckon the number of phones in trains uh, just to see how many of them are smartphones, how many of them are iPhones or Android. And uh, this is my quantitative study. The qualitative study is there, is you have this uh, gentleman folding a paper and holding his telephone and have watching a video in the train, or these guys partying with their telephone, not with a beer. So it is really part of our life. And please observe <coughs> in... In buses, for example, how many smartphones, how pe all the people use their phone and, and discover what they do uh, with their phone. Fantastic application in that industry. This is my two favorite. Uh, the first one is SNCF Direct, which is from the French railway. The second one is from uh, the UK, Jamie Oliver. The SNCF Direct, I will present that later on, is a great application if you want to know where to go in a station in France. Uh, great app, and Jamie Oliver gives you great recipe, and it's such a fantastic industry because the French are good in process and the British are good in food. So I remain in my paradox. Uh, and mobile is going to transform industries, and I know there are people from banks, and I've seen them sitting here. Uh, yes, mobile payment is going to change not only the credit card, but the bank industry. And uh, we should not sleep, uh, we should do something. Uh, I was last week in New York, uh, there was this billboard campaign, say hello to your credit card with a phone, uh, and I have put together all the mobile payment tests in uh, the US and in Europe, many of them, this is going to transform the finance industry, uh, so we have to do something very soon in this country. If you want to have a look at something very special, I think it's a world premiere, go to the Friedrichstrasse, it's 10 minutes from here, and PayPal is testing the QR shopping, which is just an application where you can buy with PayPal at a retail shop. 
It's the M store inside the Deutsche Bank concept store in the Friedrichstrasse. So take the time to go there and see how mobile payment is going to change the retail and the bank industry. If you have questions, I believe Tobias von PayPal is sitting right at the back row on the left. Uh, ask him for more details. Fantastic place to visit. So if you enter the mobile territory, it is not this. Your search had no results. And I have tipped yesterday some of the names of the companies who are sitting here. And I had some result like this in the App Store on the Play Store. It just doesn't work. And I know there are many excuses. The company culture, the punk company focuses on other things. A culture of zero mistakes. Uh, we're not going to be the first mover. We're going to be, uh, yeah, just wait and see. Uh, and also, we stick to known practices, and especially the web people in the room. They know the web, but mobile is very different. So this is my second call. My second call is just use a new logic, a new logic which suits to mobile and doesn't suit necessarily to web or to the practice you had before. And I'll go through this rapidly in three steps. The new logic is, first of all, have mobile-specific strategy mobile specific role for what you do there. Because, uh, yes, the, the old logic is really most mobile work is based on a, it's not based on a strategy, but on a rather unspecific extension of web. And to be honest, most of the time we have application outside because the CEO has an iPhone and the CEO wants to have an app. So we do an app very rapidly and the app is good or it's crap, but it's there and this way it doesn't work. So work out mobile-specific missions. Very interesting, Kayak, the travel company, has work on one specific mission, which is very clear. Mobile is number one. Mobile is lead. And you've seen two weeks ago, they roll out the new website, and the new website is actually the copy of the iPad. Another example which I love is Passe Jaune, the yellow pages from France. They really devoted a specific role to what they do in mobile in saying user interact with local businesses in all the way. They find it, they call them, they share, they navigate, and this is the way the application looks. So you look for a business, and on this page you can do anything with a business. Call them and find them on navigation. Obviously, Mappy belongs to Passion, so they integrate their own system in it. Very large success, 7.5 million downloads in France for that very application. Uh, it is the highest rate for all the local searches apart from Google. Mobile specific in one case from Germany is the Sparkasse has done a great job. Sparkasse divides banking tasks in separate mobile use case. So this is the role they gave to mobile. They have one app for the account status, one app for transaction, one app for household planning on the iPad, one app for brokerage, one for real estate, and one also with mobile tariff so that you can use the other application. Great word, but very specific for mobile. So first step. Second step is they are mobile channel and mobile product. And it's also a new logic because Yes, most marketers use mobile as an advertising channel and not truly as a mobile product. And I'll give you three examples. And to start with, I'll start with this lamp, which you see in very uh, fancy apartments or agencies. Uh, this lamp is from IKEA. So obviously, you can find this in a mobile channel, the iPad, great application with a catalog from IKEA on the iPad. But they worked out a mobile, really, product which is much near to the IKEA product experience in Sweden called Live at Hema, Live at Home. And it's a decoration, inspiration, decoration, and sharing application. So you can find some inspiration for decoration. You can comment on it and give just your feedback on it. But you can also sell and buy all the IKEA furniture through this application. So it is really in the art of the IKEA product, decorate your apartment, but also buy new furniture and change your furniture all the time. Some other example, mobile channel, a Barclay card is famous for the roller coaster game, great, more than 10 million downloads, but four weeks ago, Barclays in the UK launched Ping It, which is a share 
share, a transfer money application. Great idea, very simple. I give you 50 pounds just in putting your telephone number in the application. Um, the, the downloads are going very high. It's a very clever uh, application, and it is above all in the art of the banking system. Mark, but MasterCard is, is, is doing also a channel job here with an application from the New Yorker uh, going on, which they sponsor, which they finance. Of course, it suits to the unforgettable campaign they have worldwide. Great application. It's a channel. But obviously, they focus on the PayPass and on the Google Wallet uh, work, which is in the art of their mobile product. And since I believe some of the people hasn't seen the launch commercial for Google Wallet and PayPass, these are 15 funny seconds. You're really fun. <laughs> Thanks. So how do you feel about having kids? <laughs> so there's a series, uh, first date. Uh, so mobile channel and mobile product, but also tell a mobile story. And uh, it's really a creative exercise. And the, the new logic behind telling a mobile story is really that most app developers have built user experience to look like a long desktop uh, website. I mean, it just doesn't work. Uh, what we do and what I, I challenge you to do, uh, especially the creative in the room and the app developers, but also all the executive, is to write storyboards, so make it short. An application is very small and is, is just like writing a TV ad, a 30-second TV ad, and on a storyboard. Therefore. I came from advertising to web to mobile, and actually I took the storyboard from the advertising business into mobile just to make it short, but also to tell a story. Um, and, it, and it works, so try it all the time if you work at application to make a storyboard. Oh, great storyboard from Jamie Oliver. Well, the British have good food applications. You have a recipe, you can have the detail of the recipe, but also a video of the recipe. You get your shopping list, and you've got, in audio and in text, the, the nice tips uh, from Jamie Oliver. Another thing is uh, use wow device functions. And in the last two weeks, I had a wow experience with a, an application, a new startup in the US called Level Up. Level Up. Very hyped, very interesting, because it is so, uh, so fast. It's a payment application. So you open up the application, you do a photography of your credit card, and then you put your emails, very fast registration. You have an accredited QR code, and then you can pay. OK? So uh, and photographing the, uh, the credit card, this is with Card.io, uh, has just been a great experience. And if you mix all together, you've got the best app of the world, which is a French app. As French, I do this. Uh, <laughs> Uh, this is SNCF Direct. Um, the French Railway have many applications, but this one is only doing this. I am in a station, okay? I just have the time, destinations, and platforms, and, and train numbers. But especially if I have a delay time, I can select three radios, listen to music, listen also to the traffic information via audio on this application, and I can even buy the music behind it the best application so far I have seen. And if you do that well, bring it into the advertising. This is just a photograph of a Macy's advertising. At the bottom right, there is always the application of Macy's. If you feel you've done a good job on mobile, just put it everywhere so that it is just spread it all over the world. So this is my call today. Enter the mobile territory, the fantastic territory, but use a complete new logic a uh, mobile-specific mission to what you do, mobile channel and mobile product in the art of your business, and tell a mobile story. But you need to do one thing more for everyone. You just have to find this person. This person is a sign in your company, a sign in your agency, a sign in your department, one person, 100% 
devoted to mobile, doing nothing else than mobile. I haven't seen that very often, but when I've seen it, it made a big difference. So uh, this is my very optimistic call for a mobile adventure. And by the way, if you need a good uh, mobile agency, here we are. Thank you very much.